These are my Bundesliga Game Week 3 predictions and betting tips. Yesterday we released Premier League and La Liga, so if you haven't gone to check that out, make sure you do so. And I'm just going to let you guys know, I don't think we're going to be getting to Serie A this week. It's just a lot of research and time and effort that goes into these videos. So I think we're going to be stuck with these three for this week. I will try my best to get Serie A out next week. If you haven't, make sure you subscribe, hit that like button and drop your predictions down in the comments. Let's get in to these picks. First up, we've got Dortmund taking on Heidenheim. Now, Dortmund are unbeaten beaten in their first two games and yes they did draw last week 1-1 to Bochum they came from a goal down at halftime to equalize in the second half they completely dominated the game they controlled all, most of the possession they created plenty of chances but just weren't clinical enough to finish those chances off we've just seen now that Dortmund's been put into an absolutely nightmare group group of death in the Champions League so they're definitely going to have to perform if they want to make it out of that group and if they want a shot at the title of Bundesliga I do think they're going to get the job done here. Heidenheim coming off a 3-2 loss to Hoffenheim, where Heidenheim were actually up two goals to zero. Hoffenheim scored three goals in the last 13 minutes of the game to win that. Heidenheim are also coming off two losses starting the season. So I do think Dortmund click here, get their stuff together and get pull off a good win here. I'm going for a 3-0 Dortmund win. And my betting tip is Dortmund at a handicap of minus one and a half. <laughs> Next up, we've got Augsburg versus Bochum. Now, this is going to be a very, very tight affair. Flip a coin and pick a winner because both of these teams are coming into this match winless in their first two games. Augsburg coming off a 3-1 loss to Bayern Munich, where, to be fair, it's always going to be difficult coming up against a very, very good Bayern Munich side. They hung with them for a bit, and I don't think they'll be too disappointed with the win there. I don't think they went there and expected um, a much different result. And then Bochum, we just spoke about their 1-1 draw against Dortmund. They pushed Dortmund as far as they can, keeping the lead till well into the second half when they conceded and drew that game 1-1. Now, both of these teams are in desperate need of a win. Like I said, any one of these teams can win it. But I'm going to go with the 2 1 Augsburg win, and my betting tip is over two and a half goals. <laughs> Next up, we got Bayer Leverkusen taking on Darmstadt. Now, Bayer Leverkusen have started the season off like a house on fire. In game week one, they beat RB Leipzig 3-2. And don't forget that RB Leipzig beat Bayern Munich in their Super Cup a couple of weeks ago. They, now come, they then came up against Gladbach and beat them 3-0 away from home. So this team have started like a house on fire. They're looking very, very good. And it starts to beg the question, could Bayer Leverkusen be in the chat to win the title this year. They're coming up against Darmstadt, a newly promoted side who have, who to be to be fair to them, have very, very tough fixtures to open up uh, their campaign. Their first face off against Frankfurt, then Union Berlin got absolutely obliterated 4-1, and now they face Bayer Leverkusen. As much as I want to give Darmstadt a chance here, I don't think they have a chance. I'm going for a 3-0 Bayer Leverkusen win, and my betting tip is Bayer Leverkusen to win an over two and a half goals. <laughs> Next up, we've got Hoffenheim taking on Wolfsburg. Now, Hoffenheim has started the season off with a one with one loss and one win. We spoke about their three-two win over Hadenheim, where there were two goals down at halftime and scored three goals in the last 13 minutes. That's absolutely nuts. They've shown that they have the ability and the capability to pull off these types of results. And if they can put that together for 90 minutes, we could see a very, very good season for Hoffenheim. It's just whether they do that or not. Then Wolfsburg have started with two very, very solid wins starting the season. And the last one being a 2-1 win over Cologne where they had six big opportunities or big chances, but they only had nine shots. So when they do have the ball, they are clinical. They're creating opportunities. And if they can just be slightly more lethal in attack in that final third, Wolfsburg could also be looking at a very, very good season here. I do think this one's tight. Hoffenheim has shown ability. Wolfsburg are in very, very good form at the moment. I'm going for a 2-1 Wolfsburg win. And my betting tip is Wolfsburg to win or draw. <laughs> Next up, we've got Verde taking on Mainz. Now, both of these sides have not won a game yet in their campaign. Verde are coming off a 1-0 loss against Freiburg, where they pushed them to the 96th minute. It was 0-0, and then Freiburg scored uh, the winning goal in the 96th minute. To be fair to Freiburg... Verde just weren't there. I mean, they conceded four big chances. They didn't deserve to win the game or even draw the game. And I think that was the correct result. Like I said, haven't got off to the greatest of starts and they need to bounce back here with a win. Then Mainz also haven't won a game in their first two. They come in off a 1-1 draw against Frankfurt and they gave away a 1-0 lead in the second half. Now, Mainz 
are decent side and they should be pulling off results here and there. This is a very, very difficult one to call. It could go either way. I'm going to stay on the fence and go for a 1-1 draw. And my betting tip is under two and a half goals. <laughs> Next up, we got Stuttgart taking on Freiburg. Now, Stuttgart from week one to two, completely polar opposite results. They started off with a 5-0 win over Bochum, and then last week, they got absolutely obliterated by RB Leipzig, losing that game 5-1. Now, Stuttgart probably didn't deserve to concede five goals there. RB Leipzig weren't that great, but their finishing was very, very good, and that's exactly why they won that game 5-1. This is going to be a tough game for Stuttgart. We spoke about Freiburg's 1-0 win over Werder, showing that they can win from basically any situation, scoring that goal in the 96th minute. They've now started with back-to-back -back wins, and they will look to make it three. I think Freiburg just get this done. I'm going for a 2-1 Freiburg win. My betting tip is both teams to score. <laughs> Next up, we got Gladbach taking on Bayern Munich. Now, I have a feeling that this is going to be a bit of a long day for Gladbach. They're coming off a 3-0 loss against Bayer Leverkusen. They're winless in their first two. And in their first two games, they've conceded seven goals. Now, Bayern Munich, on the other hand, have started like a house on fire. 3-1 win over Augsburg last week. They have scored seven goals in their first two games. So, uh, Gladbach have conceded seven. Bayern Munich has scored seven. Harry Kane, what a signing for Bayern Munich. I want to see exactly what he's going to be able to do in the Champions League. I'm not going to waste much time. I think this is going to be an easy game for Bayern Munich. I'm going for a 4-0 Bayern Munich win. And my betting tip is Bayern Munich at a handicap of minus one and a half. <laughs> Next up, we've got Frankfurt taking on Cologne. Now, Frankfurt are unbeaten in their first two games. We spoke about their 1-1 draw against Mainz, where they came back from a 1-0 goal down against Mainz to draw that game. Cologne, they've lost both of their opening games, so they're in dire need of a win. That 2-1 loss to Wolfsburg last week after they had a 1-0 lead and then got dominated in that second half and eventually ended up losing a 2-1. I do think Frankfurt... Should be able to get this done. Cologne will desperately want to bounce back, but I don't think it's going to happen. I'm going for a 2-0 Frankfurt win, and my betting tip is Frankfurt to win. In the biggest game of the weekend, Union Berlin taking on RB Leipzig. Now, Union Berlin have started off like a house on fire. We thought Bayer Leverkusen started off hot. They've started even hotter. A 4-1 win in game week one and a 4-1 win in game week two. Goal scoring machines at the moment. And I think they will favor themselves against this RB Leipzig side. RB Leipzig didn't start off too well with a 3-2 loss against Bayer Leverkusen, but then bounced back with that 5-1 win over Stuttgart. I mean, I think this is going to be end-to-end -end stuff, goals galore. It's very, very close to call, but I'm going to go for a 2-2 draw, and my betting tip is both teams to score. Thank you. 